Let's talk about diatomic molecules and tie that into calculations. Two key kinds of molecules we're going to talk about in this lesson. Monatomic, where we have single atoms. This is typically with noble gases, for example, neon. And then we have diatomic, and that means we have two atoms of the same element bonded together. Okay, let me show you a couple of examples. Hydrogen is a diatomic gas. So if I look here, this is how many valence electrons hydrogen has. So its Lewis dot structure looks like this. And then if I had a second hydrogen like this, now they're bonded. Okay, here is what they might look like if you use a Bohr model, right? Oxygen is also a diatomic gas, but this Bohr model looks a little different because oxygen has two energy levels. Look at that, two electrons in the first energy level, six electrons in the second energy level, okay? So oxygen, though, because it has six, it has six valence electrons, three, four, five, six. Put it next to another oxygen, and what ends up happening is you get a double bond between them. Because remember, all electrons have to pair up, and it looks like this, or that in a Bohr model. But when we're asked to draw a Lewis dot structure, this is not Lewis dot, that's Bohr. This is a Lewis dot structure, okay? But what we're focusing on is what are the diatomic molecules? So here they are in the periodic table. See hydrogen, whoop, 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 way over there by itself. Then we have this little L shape, okay? And you can see it's almost all, this is group 17. It's pretty much all the members of group 17. Hydrogen, because it really is a weirdo. It's different about everything. And then you have these two, okay? You can use a phrase to help you remember. And that phrase is Brinkelhoff. 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 Okay. So bromine, iodine, nitrogen, chlorine, hydrogen, oxygen, fluorine. Brinkelhoff. Bromine, iodine, nitrogen, chlorine, hydrogen, oxygen, fluorine. Brinkelhoff. Okay. How do you write the formulas for diatomic elements? Well, let me show you an example from a question. If a question says hydrogen gas, what formula should you write for hydrogen gas? Well, hydrogen is in Brinkelhoff, which means it's diatomic, which means I have to write it as H2. You cannot write it as single H. You will be wrong. If a question says nitrogen gas, what is the chemical formula for, for nitrogen gas? Yeah, N2. If you just write N, you are wrong. If a question says oxygen gas, what is the chemical formula for oxygen gas? Yeah, O2. If you just write O, you are wrong. All right, so what does this mean for calculations? Let me show you. If a question says how many moles are in 0 0.14 gram sample of nitrogen gas, Remember the formula for moles is moles equals grams over gram formula mass. So how many moles are in 0 0.14, that's the grams, so I'm trying to find moles, right? Divided by, now I need the gram formula mass. I need the gram formula mass of what? Nitrogen gas. What did you learn? You have to write that as N2, right? You look up nitrogen on the periodic table, it's 14, but times two, right? So divided by 28, you divide those numbers and that gives you the answer for moles. What about if you have this question? How many grams are in a 1.17 mole sample of hydrogen gas? So again, it's moles equals grams over gram formula mass. This time we have 1.17 moles, 
we're being asked to find grams, and we need gram formula mass. What do we have here? Hydrogen gas. What is the formula for hydrogen gas? H2. So the atomic mass is 1 times 2, right? So 2 is my gram formula mass. What did I tell you to do? Turn it into cross multiplying, please. Makes it so much easier. Put it over 1. Now you can cross multiply. 1 times grams is just grams equals, and then you're going to multiply these two numbers together, and that will give you your answer in grams. Okay, so you have to remember that when you see the words oxygen gas or nitrogen gas or oxygen gas, that it's diatomic. So hopefully this will help you remember those diatomic molecules. Wrinkelhoff, Wrinkelhoff, Wrinkelhoff.